Hello survivors, welcome back to another video. How are you today, guys? Let me know in the comments. We have a new update here, and to be honest, we are having problems because when I click here, uh, it doesn't give me the option to update, but let's see what they add. Uh, hand painting Easter eggs. Ah, yeah, the same recycle events, I guess. Easter emergency state load. Yeah, one of those events that they always release with an HQ skin. Hand painting Easter Easter eggs, luminous blazing. The event will be more is better during the. Blah, blah, blah. Ah yes, this is just the Easter event, and this is what I'm gonna talk about today, the hero training area. Now they released the hero training area in other states, and basically what it gives you is just the opportunity to get these heroes to level 80, so you get the benefits of March capacity mainly, instead of trying to upgrade them here, for example, using your combat manuals and you know that to get anything to level 80 you have to basically like upgrade into the general rank but in newer states we had an option before which was the training area that it wasn't necessary to upgrade your heroes to general rank so you only just could put them to the training area and as long as you had one of the instructors here and they are all purple hero of course for free to play players as long as they are at level 80 they can train kind of like train the other ones which are not level 30 or level general sorry or rank general sorry and they can get the benefits of the march capacity and stuff so before they were like 15 slots available now they release five more i guess so four more so how many do we have here 9 12 15 uh yeah four more five more if you are like plasma what this is plasma five yeah level 35 is yeah if you are plasma six i guess like no it should be available here uh upgrade hero pre ah yeah my hero present yeah uh, once you upgrade your hero present to plasma five then you're gonna get this and of course the more the higher you are you're gonna unlock all this and that's good because remember if you are like a, a player and you are marching six marches then you are gonna realize that your first march, march you can march more troops and in the other one maybe the same amount of troops but your third march your fourth and fifth march you are always having problems to march the same capacity because all not, not all your heroes are general uh, or not not all your i cannot even talk today guys well not all your heroes are level 80 but with these benefits you can put all those heroes that you usually march in your fifth fourth and sixth march and that's gonna give you the ability to march more troops even in those uh, weaker kind of marches so what I'm gonna do today here is to put on my training area their heroes that I usually march in the fourth or in the fifth march, uh, so I can get the benefits of marching more troops. I usually march like Grim, and as you can see here, I'm getting like benefits in battle power. Uh, I'm gonna do this one. I don't remember the name of this hero. Yeah, uh, that's a lot of BP. And then I'm gonna do, what's the other one? Mm, Nicola, I guess, is marching. Yeah, and then I'm gonna do, I don't know, is it Ash, maybe? Becca, no, Ash. Yeah, I think Ash is, is a decent hero for me. Yeah, so I think now if I march all my marches, are they gonna have the same capacity? Let's see. 158, 158, 158, and 158. Yeah, you see, before I couldn't march 158 because, as you can see, my hero, for example, um, where is my other march? No, this one's. I couldn't march 158 because, for example, Grim, he was saying level 80 and this one uh, this one the one in the middle i don't know the name one more time it wasn't level 80 so because they were not level 80 i didn't have the benefits of march capacity but now that i put them on the hero precinct and the training area 
I can just march 158 in my fourth marches, in my first fourth marches. So that's super, super good. Uh, yeah, we also have the, just going to talk about other things here, the supply, supply boxes. Remember what I always tell you guys, get the crowbar, but to use them for the other one, uh, which give you like uh, material for the budget. And that's what you want to do because for this one, you get uh, it is not worth it first of all for this one and for the other one you get them through the trap and what else do we have here uh, battle power up if you have been training troop line normal you should be able to complete this event hunting the hunter remember don't call rallies get the benefits of uh, spending the stamina and getting some stamina back so just kill infected zombies around and you're gonna get a lot of benefits then we have a lion throw down I'm doing super bad here, guys. I have been super busy. <laughs> 9,000. Yeah, I'm still relatively close to the top five, but I have to work my eight off if I want to beat. I'm not catching Max. Max is going crazy, going bananas. And they have been refreshing the task a little bit better. And, oh, well, what, what I saw the last couple of days. Ah, uh, man, those 430 tasks, they don't come out. I don't know what's going on, but <laughs> yeah, I could use this one 270, 270, but yeah, I have to spend a lot of speed ups. Um, I want to say my speed ups for the T11, so so yeah, it is what it is. Uh, we have the reservoir rate uh, or leak uh, this uh, Sunday. I will try to join. Uh, and yeah, uh, if I join, I won't record because I'm gonna be busy. Um, I'm gonna be playing at work if I like manage to to, to log in. But as soon as uh, I can record one of the fights, I will, guys, just to show you how I play in the new alliance. Because yeah, in the other one, I was kind of like you know we were like super weak, and yeah, I was kind of like sometimes uh, a soup rally leader, you know, trying to help the guys to to take the building. And in this one, I'm super weak, to be honest. All these people are super strong. So I'm not even gonna call rallies. And, and yeah, our strategy is so super different. That they are a little bit more organized and stuff than us, to be honest. Uh, and we do this course. So there is a lot of more going on. And I like that, like in terms of strategy. Um, but uh, I have to join. I have to join to be able to, to see what's going on. But uh, I'm sad that I cannot participate anymore. And then we have uh, next week, I guess, a stay versus a stay. Let's see. I'm looking forward to that. What else do we have, guys? Uh, we don't have anything else. We have, ah, yeah, this one. Join exercise. I always forget about this. Let's see if, ah, I just recall my troop for gathering. This is annoying because every time you join here, all your troops goes, go back to the settlement. And if you are gathering or you are reinforcing other players, or if you are joining rallies, then all your troops come back. And it's just annoying. Sometimes I forget, like today. Uh, yeah, I didn't finish together. So now this one, I can kill it easy. And we're gonna get to level, mm, what's this one? Level 96. We are close to that 100 level. And um, save, guys, save your material. One more time, you don't wanna hear this word, but you have to save your material for other events. Now, there are a lot of events asking you for like this carbon thing or for like aircraft material and if you save a lot of those plus the the normal resources that you usually use like speed ups like uh, plasma cores and stuff you're gonna get a good rank guys and if you pair that with migo you know chances of getting like good rewards are higher so yeah play the long term and, and don't be like just uh thinking about short-term gratification like oh yeah i'm gonna be stronger now no because remember for the last couple of months comparing me to uh even a low spender or a free-to-play player i was strong but remember being strong for one two months doesn't mean that you're gonna keep getting stronger or you are gonna be stronger for for the rest of the of the, the of your life playing the game you know now with the new generation heroes if you compare my stats with those who got the new generation i'm kind of weaker you know my style the stats are not that high 
um, because I just making the trade off of like holding a little bit and then get it super strong later. So it is what it is as a free to play player, low spender, that's what you have to do. If you try to max out every generation or spend resources in every generation, yeah, you are gonna end up with like a, a lot of decent marches, but none of the marches are gonna be like super, super strong. So I prefer to have a few decent marches, a one super, super strong, because that one, you know, I can use it to attack and the other ones to protect me. Or in the worst case scenario, you know, uh, I can use both to attack and protect. So yeah, it is uh, super necessary to have a strong march, especially when there are a lot of things coming out. We have the hero gear, we have the budget, we have the new heroes, we have the aircraft, we have the Nanami statue. Ah man, we have a lot of things. So yeah, the game is going crazy and those stats are gonna be soon on the 2000. So in my, in my stats now are 1100 and in a few months it is just gonna be like 2000. So if I don't hurry up and save and invest in, in, the, in the new generations which are coming, then man with one solo attack from an spender it is gonna do a lot of damage so i just wanna wanna play smart in the long term because you never know and you have to be ready guys the other thing that you have to keep in mind is that you have to be ready for for a, a state versus a state because um when state versus state comes uh, what i hear is that uh, it gets kind of like in the beginning everybody's fighting against everybody and if you are not strong guys it's not like state versus state which is just one day and you bubble for the whole day if you want and nobody's gonna attack you here is your new state so you are gonna be here 24 hours 30 65 days or at least till the, the things settle a little bit and it usually takes weeks, so you cannot be just bubble the whole week or the whole two months that it takes for the alliances to fight for territory and stuff. So you need to be strong. You need to be strong so that the people is reckon you and they see you. Oh, a lot of troops and good heroes. That nah, this is gonna be a waste of resources. And they don't attack you and they go for the weaker ones. So. I recommend you that now i'm gonna shut this video here guys uh, it's just long enough i hope you enjoy see you next time